I, I remember when I was, you know, maybe eight or ten, um, after school I used to go uh, down to the airstrip there and watch the airplanes coming and going and you'd hear them taking off and you couldn't wait to get out of school and go <laughs> down and check out what was going on. It was quite an adventure to actually go flying. Back in the 60s it was new and it was exciting and I just sort of felt that was where I where I wanted to be. I wanted to be you know, up there in, in the aircraft. In 1972 I got an apprentice aircraft engineering job. During that time I had the opportunity to, to learn to fly here. I can't really remember the first time because there were so many times we went flying, you know. Yeah, but it's just that thrill of leaving the ground for the first time. It's, it's an exhilarating experience that you never forget. The unique thing about Queenstown and the surrounding areas is the beauty of the lakes and the mountains. There's nowhere else like that in New Zealand or in the world. And when you go further west to Milford, it's even more, more stunning. Especially if you're flying along the clouds and you're sort of like a sky dancer and the mystical part of Fjordland and this area here, showing people what you actually can show them because you can't see it any other way unless you're up there looking down, you know. There's, there's so much variety in it and it gives you so much of a challenge every time you go out there. Uh, my name is Hank Sproul, I'm the owner and CEO of Air Milford and I fly for the passion of aviation.